Life Code. Welcome to Live Code. This video will talk about how to save a list of objects in Spring Data JPA. First, we have created a Spring Boot application. We need to include several dependencies in palm.xml. They are Starter Web, Start Data JPA H2, Lombok, and Hibernate JPA Model Gen. Remember to reload Maven in IntelliJ. Second, we have to configure the application.yaml file. We have enabled console log, set up H2 data source connection. In this case, we will run the application under the 8099 port. Then, we have an entity called the movie entity. It contains three fields. ID, name, and description. It will be a table in the H2 database. Also, we have an interface called the movie repository. It will interact with our H2 database. Moreover, there is a movie service interface, which we will implement later. In the Spring Boot application class, we have implemented the command line runner interface. It will call the run method when started. Let's implement the save movie method. We have created a class to implement the movie service interface. Inside save movie method, we have to create two movie entities. They are Star Wars and Avengers. Then, we will put them into an object list. Next, we call the movie repository save all method to save the list to the H2 database. Finally, we log the record size and value into the console. Let's run the application. The console log showed two records saved. Go to the H2 console. Log into the console by using the username and password configured in the application.yam. Select the movie table, click the run button. We can see there are two records inserted into the H2 database. Thank you for watching the video. Remember to like the video, also subscribe to the channel.